everybody, what is going on? It is Dunbar Snack Bar with Madden 25, and of course, we've got some Teddy Crocker coming your way right here. We're going to be facing the Cincinnati Bengals. Now, I played through this twice. Um, first time, I thought I had it saved. Apparently, I didn't. So, this is round number two, I guess you could say, of playing the Bengals. Now, Teddy Crocker has had a tremendous first part of the season. I absolutely loved playing as him because of all the great runs we've been able to put together and it's really gotten me motivated to be able to use the running game I'm sure you guys like would notice if you go back and you look like the first games I did of like NCAA I was like all passing and since I went ahead and started Teddy Crocker yeah I'm going with a lot more uh, of a ground game which is cool because I need to have a balanced offense and Teddy Crocker has over the last couple years now given me that so second and four, Aaron Rodgers is going to get sacked right here, which is not what I needed. It's going to set up third and long. So obviously I'm going to have to go ahead and choose a passing play to try and get out of that one here. But Teddy Crocker gets pulled, so I don't get to do anything at all. But we get the ball back here in great field position. Cobb not able to hold on to that one, so we're looking at second and ten. Now I'm going to be going with a run to the outside. Ah. <sighs> Just when I start to think that I'm going to be getting something going right here with the great field position that we have, I'm going to lose five yards. False start on us. So I'm going to call the same play here. And this looks like it could be really pretty. And I'm going to dive forward into the end zone for the first touchdown of the game for Teddy Crocker. So a great time to go ahead and pitch it to the outside. Now field position isn't as great for us. We've got it at our 20-yard line. But Aaron Rodgers, that one is going to be incomplete. I thought he had that one, but apparently not. That's okay. So running forward here, picking up a good amount of yards through the middle part of the field. 43 yards already for Teddy. Heck yes. A minute to go here in the first quarter. Third and two, giving it to Teddy Crocker again. Bob and Weave right there. That's the name of the game for Teddy. Just getting around everybody and getting the first down. So the thing that's nice, of course, is I do just get to choose plays for Aaron Rodgers. And I can manipulate everything, too. So I changed the hot routes on that one. It was a smart call. Makes it second and three. Going to be going with uh, some passes again. I got to keep the defense honest. I can't be running the ball every single time with Teddy Crocker because if that's the case then well that's not going to go well at all and then Aaron Rodgers is probably going to be on a cold streak as well as all the receivers so got to be fair with stuff Aaron Rodgers goes down again this time losing 8 yards that's going to put us at the Cincinnati 30 yard line alright so little play action here Jones with the catch and a great pickup actually after that that one catch uh, I thought he would have been tackled and dropped right where he caught it, but apparently not. Pick up a seven yards right there. That's going to give us an even 60 now here in this game as we are in the second quarter. Clock is ticking. 4.40 to go. Toss to Crocker. And he's going to get tripped up from behind. Man, that one's always tough too because I don't know if I'm supposed to like jump or anything, like if I hit triangle, and even if I do... Yeah, if that's, you know, going to go ahead and, and avoid it. And when do I know when that's going to take place? So uh, here I am choosing the screenplay. My bad. I thought I'd cut that out. Apparently I didn't, but I'm not going to go back and start over. That's okay. Crocker with the catch. A great block in front of me here. And that is what got me the touchdown. I'm always going to give credit here to the offensive lineman or anybody who blocks in front of me. Just because I think that when you take a look at big plays, the blocking is not always recognized. So that time, it wasn't just Teddy. It wasn't the play call. It was blocking. Eight-yard pickup right there. We might have a 200-yard game if we keep going like this. Two minutes and 20 seconds now. Cutting up field, not getting too much, but... The fact of the matter is, we get the first down. So this drive is, of course, still going. Two-minute warning has come and gone. I don't know if Cincinnati's expecting me to go ahead and just be passing the ball. But look at the score. 24 to nothing right now. Cincinnati really needs to get their act together. 
haven't had too much going necessarily offensively, but there's just been some great stuff going on on the other side of the ball that's helped us to be able to get some points on the board. So I can't take the credit right now for a 24 to nothing score. Yeah, I don't know what uh, Teddy was doing on that one. It wasn't pretty. But now we're looking at second and 10, and well, I get pulled after that, so here we are in the third quarter. So we're in the second half now, still 24 to nothing. We've got 111 yards now. So I can do this. I mean, I can go ahead and, and get 200 yards before the end of the game. That'd be really cool. Cobb with the catch. Like I said, this is not going to be all Teddy Crocker. I know this is his series, but I'm not going to be running the ball every single time with him. Jones picking up five. And I get pulled, and I come back in. And look at this. It's like giving me a gift. Second and goal here at the three-yard line. But I'm only going to pick up one yard there. So third and goal. The question is, are they going to keep me in? Looks like that they are. So let's go with a toss over here to the right. Cutting back in. And another touchdown here for Teddy. Packers really have taken this game and made sure that Cincinnati has no chance of winning. 31 to nothing. I shouldn't say no chance, but a ridiculously small chance right now. Jones staying in bounds, which was nice to be able to see because it seems like a lot of my wide receivers like to go out of bounds. Less than two minutes to go. The toss, again, some great blocking in front of me. And the unnecessary jump. I didn't have to do that. I would have been in anyway. But this has been, just for the entire uh, Green Bay team, this game has just been phenomenal. So Bengals get on the board here with the touchdown themselves. We're now in the fourth quarter. We're looking at second and seven. And this play that has worked so well here, the toss to the outside, well, works enough for us to go ahead and get the first down. Again, tripped up from behind. I might have to look into that. Like, if there's anything I can do to combat that. Or I'm sure somebody will post something in the comments. Now, I keep looking for the total amount of yards that Teddy Crocker has gotten because I want to get 200 yards. Now, I think we're going to be able to get that since we've got six minutes to go in the game. So I'm not too worried. I don't want to go ahead and rush it. Cobb not able to bring that one on in. I expect more out of him. He needs to have better hands than that. All right, so another passing play. Nelson's going to go in motion. Crocker just cutting straight up. Going to break one tackle, but that's going to be it here. So 36 yards uh, receiving here for Teddy. What's this? Oh, delay a game. My bad. I get this bad habit of, like, while I'm playing games, sometimes I'll have something going on YouTube that I'm watching, and I'll get so focused on that that I'll just forget to look at the time, and I think this was one of those situations still first down. all right so at least we're still in field goal range we got first and 15 i'm going to be changing up the play here based off what i see from the defense that was a smart call because i think if i had continued with that play i would not have been looking at second and four right now probably like third and 14. all right so again going with the pass so crocker just kind of Cutting over to the left here, but Jones will get the reception. I think that was a smart call to go to him. All right. So, maybe I'll get something this time. Nope, not to me. Cobb. A great catch. Keeps both feet in bounds. And now we're looking at first and goal at the one. Now, I would go ahead and kneel the ball, but that's not going to happen here. That's not going to do me any good right there. Especially with as much time as there is left. No, I, I wasn't going to kneel the ball. But I want to run the uh, clock out as much as I could, which is why I was going with the running play right there. But 44-7. to seven. My gosh. And we get the ball back at our 46-yard line. That'll get me across midfield to the 48. We've got 177 yards now for Teddy. Just one big play. That's all I need. A big hit, though, against Teddy. He'll go down. 24 yards to go. We're at the 39-yard line. Two-minute warning has come and gone. Pickup of three. All right. So 
I'm not going to rub it in or anything. Don't want to be that type of guy. But Teddy Crocker, if I break away from everybody and I can get a touchdown, I'm all about it. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to do the good thing, and we're going to end the game with that. So Aaron Rodgers takes a knee. And that's going to be a big win right here for the Packers, winning 44-7 to against the Bengals. That was about what the score was the last time I played it, too, and I wasn't able to save it. So looks like Hayward's going to be the player of the game. One interception, a sack, two tackles. That's all right. I don't know if I got my 200 yards. I, I can't remember, to be honest. But anyway, it was a big day for Teddy, so I can't complain about that. Thanks for watching, you guys. I sure do appreciate it. More of this to come later on, so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, all that great jazz. But you guys are phenomenal people. You really are. Thank you again. And as always, I hope you have a good one.